In this video, we're going to look at three ways to apply the compass tool in GeoGebra. So the compass tool is typically found with your other circle tools. Mine's right here, and it's red. It says compass. Um, as the instructions say, you can select two points, A and B, and that will then be the radius of your circle. Or you can select the segment itself, click that, and that will become the radius of the circle. Right? And your third click, both times you noticed, is the center of the circle. So when I clicked over AB, right, there's no center until I tell it I want a center over here. What's another way to use the compass tool? Well, another nice feature of the compass tool is that you can copy circles quickly. So if I have, let's say, this circle right here, AF, and I want a copy of that circle, how do I do that? Well, I could select the Move tool, click, copy, control C or command C, and then control or command V to paste the circle. Of course that works. But the compass tool is also helpful. With the compass tool, all you need to do is click the circle itself and it copies it, which I think is nice. Also, you can copy the circle by clicking the center of the circle and the circle itself, and it will copy the circle for you. So there's a bunch of ways to use this tool, and I'm sure we'll find more um, as we learn more about GeoGebra. Thanks.